I volunteer at a place where we dress up, you know, we dress professionally dress um, women from all walks of life, homeless people, whatever, domestic violence. It doesn't matter who you are, what you are. We don't ask questions, right? A bunch of people, women donate suits and things and shoes and bags and nah, 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 to this place. And I volunteer like many, many other people. <sighs> Today I went in because there, there was a call for volunteers, right? So today I go in and all these young girls are coming in. We're talking about maybe like four, between 16 and like 18, right? All high school kids. And I'm having conversation with them and trying to find out what's going on. Because normally when you come in, we don't ask questions. We just put you in nice suits and shoes. You get to pick what you want, skirt suits, pantsuits. As long as it's professional, you're getting it and a handbag, right? And some pearls. So today, something said ask questions. So I started asking the young women, what, you know, where are you coming from? Turns out there's an agency. And I spoke to the director of the program. So, dear black people, what is killing us is ignorance. It's not just racism. Because all these programs are out there. Instead of sending your children to football camps and basketball camps and this sports camp, how about we do more research and find out about the programs that are already out there for everyone? Bottom line is today, I found out about certain schools that are magnet programs. <laughs> God help me. Like really college prep schools. And it's free. Taxpayers pay the money, right? I found out about all these agencies that take in young girls and teaches them how to go for job interviews, shake hands, yada, 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 teach them emotional intelligence, work etiquette, and how to manage themselves. And then they come to us and we dress them in suits and whatever they need to go to do this job. And after that, they're placed for at an internship. See, most a lot of black people don't do internships. I get that parents need money and people need money and all of that, but there's a price that we have to pay to be able to get seats where the laws are being created. We can no longer con continue to cry foul when the resources are out there. I get that a lot of us don't know because I just found out this today. But what I'm saying is that there's a lot of information out there. If you'd like to find out more about this information, definitely DM me. I'll send you the information. There's a lot of summer schools, summer programs, summer education-wise. But we spend all our time on sports. A lot of people spend their time on sports. Only one person can be Michael Jordan. Only one person can be LeBron James. If we prepare our children and make them job ready. These kids are 14, 15, 16, already doing internships at corporations. How do you compete with that if you don't get the information? We spend so much time on social media. We spend so much time online. Do research, my people. Dear black people, the only person that can save you and I is you and I. We have to do the work. The resources are out there. We just need to find out about it. <sighs> I'm telling you, there's so much resources out there. Maybe I'll make that my thing. But I found out about three schools in Texas today. Three schools, magnet programs. And I found out about three organizations. I don't, I don't know if anybody does this for men because I think the, men, the young boys needed a lot more probably than the girls. But I'll do some more research and I'll come back to you. Look out for part two.